The mutex class provides us with a functionality similar to the lock construct. We can use mutex class in order to synchronize between different threads. Unlike using the lock construct, those different threads can be part of separated different applications. How can we use that feature in order to ensure that a specific given application won't be executed in more than one occurrence? Let's take a look at this code sample. First, we instantiated mutex, and then we called the wait1 method on the mutex object we got. Wait1 method is the method that tries to get a mutex. In other words, calling wait1 means trying to get a lock. If a mutex isn't available, then wait1 blocks and waits till it is available unless we specify a time limit specifying a time limit if we call the wait1 method on a mutex object and the time limit path without being able to get to acquire the mutex then wait1 returns false so this is how we can identify a situation in which this specific application is already up and running. If we get true, then we go to this code section where we execute the main application code that can be placed within another separated method, like in this code sample, the method run. And when run ends, within the finally block we release the mutex let's see how does it work we should open two separated command line in order to execute the same application concurrently or at least try to do it Let's execute the application here in this command line window and uh, get a message saying the application is running. Let's try to run the application in another separated command line window and it tries to get the mutex. Once fail, we get a message that another instance of this application is already running.